Hi, I'm Jackson Rathbone. I play Jasper in Twilight. I am naturally a brunette, not a blonde. And in the first movie, you see my real hair. And in the next two films, those are wigs. The last two movies, it was my hair again. In the baseball scene of vampire baseball in Twilight, you see Jasper twirling a bat around. Now that was actually just me uh, hanging out uh, between filming. I was just practicing, just trying to do something interesting with the bat when I stepped up to the, to the plate there. But a lot of people thought it was fake and it was a CGI and it is not CGI and I can still do it to this day. I'm actually a Texan. I grew up in Midland, Texas and when I was playing Jasper, uh, who's also a Texan, it was kind of a, a very easy fit for me to step into those cowboy boots, which I fought for, by the way. We actually filmed in Portland, Oregon, as opposed to Washington, uh, which is in the books, it's Forks, Washington. The entire city of Forks, Washington has been turned into essentially a living Twilight Museum where you can be a part of the world of Twilight. Nikki Reed and I, is, she's my, my, my sweetheart, I love that girl so much. She is the godmother of my firstborn son. I think my friendship with, with Nikki Reed started at a very, very interesting moment at Southwest Terminals in Burbank Airport. I was trying to get on the airplane and I was carrying my guitar with me because I'm also a musician. And the stewardess said, you can't bring that guitar on the plane. And this voice behind me comes up, this angelic voice says, excuse me, ma'am, I, I can vouch for him. He'll get it on there. He, he's definitely done it before. And I look back and there's this beautiful creature I've never met before, Nikki Reed. And she vouched for me and she was able to help me get my guitar on the plane without ever having met me before and that was the start of a beautiful friendship. There have been rumors and speculations that the cast might get together again for a 10 year, 15 year, even 20 year anniversary, and only time will tell. But probably yes. Over the course of filming these movies, we, 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 we all, the Cullens, we got really close and uh, we would have family dinners at, at Peter's apartment. He would cook us, I think, like canned spaghetti because we didn't really have the greatest um, greatest kitchen setups. So after finishing Breaking Dawn part one and two, we, we, we filmed them both back to back. And over the course of that time, I fell in love and I had my firstborn son, Monroe. And uh, actually, the first time we ever had a babysitter was for uh, Breaking Dawn part one. And uh, we had him in a, in a hotel, like right next to the premiere. Being back in Portland for the 10 year anniversary, Man, they, they put us up in the same hotel and it, it brought back all these memories of, of uh, sitting up in the hotel after hours, jamming with the co-stars. Actually, Robert Pattinson and I played the local bar next door, Kelly's, at an open mic night. One of the songs that I started writing in Portland on the original Twilight, you're gonna see on the American Spirit Blues album I have coming up.